guys so as you see from the title I'm going to show you um, some of my favorite nail care products and the things that have helped me grow out my nails and I'm also going to do my nails in the process to kind of just give you guys a feel so this is the manicure I'm going to take off and the first thing is this acetone this is um, a company um, sold at Sally Beauty Supply called Beauty Secrets Acetone and it has vitamin E in the acetone and a protein. This helps with um, your nails, you know, giving your pro your nails protein that it needs because acetone kind of strips away that, um, you know, all the good stuff in your nails. So you want to um, have something that kind of adds it back in and this is good especially for me because I do my nails probably about um, every other day so using an acetone that's just not as harsh on my nails is good so I'm just going to use this so I'm just going to use this to take off my nail polish okay so the polish is off my nails um, as you can see they're kind of yellowish at the tip and I, this is just because I paint my nails a lot and they um, kind of get stained and also obviously that's the oldest part of your nail because that's the part that's growing out um so and I did have acrylics on when I started um, trying to grow out my nails so I also think that's because of the acrylics the staining um, now I don't know if you guys can tell but also my nails kind of peel at the ends um, they like split it's kind of hard to explain it's like they grow in layers and then they just kind of split as they grow um, like the layers kind of peel up and I used to like peel off the layer top layer and then like kind of try and file it down and that really didn't work and my nails just kept breaking and breaking so after I um, started leaving them alone and just letting them grow and stop peeling them they um, continue to grow and just get stronger I'm just going to uh, trim up my nails a little bit and this is the clipper that I use this is a straight edge um, nail clipper it's not like a curved one uh, as you can see it's not curved and it is by tweezer man so as you can see I because I have a straight edge clipper, I can just clip a straight line or it's fairly straight. And then I'm gonna take my nail file and I'm just going to file in one direction. Make sure you try not to file in back and forth like sawing motions. You don't wanna do that because it just causes your nails to peel more and to snag more. So I'm just going to file in one direction. And I like this uh, square nail shape, so I'm just going to keep it nice and straight across. Okay, my nails are cut and filed down, as you can see. Um, you know, I'm not a perfectionist when it comes to filing. Um, I just do the best I can. The next step, I'm going to use some cuticle oil. My favorite cuticle oil right now is, or well, this is a cuticle cream. This is by Burt's Bees. Um, a lot of people talk about this as being a great cuticle cream, and so far I like it. Uh, this is, I just purchased it, and I've been using it for about a week. And I'm just going to rub a little bit on my cuticles. And then I'm going to take a cotton ball with um, some more acetone on it and I'm gonna wipe off the surface of my nail because you can't have anything <clears throat> can't have anything on your nail when you're about to paint them because then your nail polish won't stick to it so you're just gonna wipe off the cuticle oil that's on the surface of your nail another product that's been assisting in the growth of my nails is this Sally Hansen thicken up strengthener um, I use this as a base coat as well as a treatment it's just a clear um, polish does is it allows you to thicken up your nails as they grow out if your nail is weak you can use this as a treatment so you just paint your nail um, with a couple coats of this on the like the the first go around and then you wait a couple days and then you add another layer wait a couple days add another layer wait a couple days add another layer 
and as you add the layers it like uh, builds up your the strength of your nail so it's strengthening your nail underneath as well as building on layers like with the polish each polish or each coat becomes another layer now I'm going to paint my nails as usual and the color I'm going to be using is by nail teeny got this in one of my ipsy bags and it is called adios okay so my nails are painted so um, the next thing I'm going to use also like I said aided in the help of allowing my nails to grow and for me to retain length and they are hardeners and strengtheners um, these are from Sally Hansen first one is a hardener specifically just hardens up hardens up your nails like I said my nails are usually flimsy and you know to the point that they would just bend it right in half and just snap right off and then there's also strengtheners which is this uh, tinted one um, helps with the growth of your nail gives your nail the vitamins and things that it needs and um, it you know allows you to be able to grow your nail out and help you retain length these I put on before I put on my top coat um, this time I'm going to use the hardener but I alternate between either one um, you can just choose whatever one you feel like your nails need okay the last step is top coat and this is Sesh Vite. this is a fast drying top coat and it really does mean fast drying literally as soon as I finish painting my nails I put my nail stuff away and I can go about my night get right in the bed and not have to worry about my manicure being messed up in the morning so this is a super thick top coat um, I love this stuff because it gives me great shine number one and it gives me a thick layer last final layer sealing in all my color all my nail art or whatever um, and it really just locks it in and it also helps protect my nail once again focusing on the tip allows it to protect the tip of my nail and helping me and maintaining my length which is what I want to do um, in the end it's all about retaining length at the tips of your nail and my manicure is complete and if you have any questions about um, nail care or anything like that make sure you leave me a comment down below and also like the video and share if you enjoyed it and you want to see more nail care videos make sure you check out my this month in nail polish videos where I just show you all the manicures that I've done throughout the month and things like that thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in my next one bye